Today, I'm going to explain to you one of the longest running TV shows in American history. They have 10 years in the making and they are still going strong called Supernatural. It finished last week. I haven't seen more than like two episodes of the show, but after an hour and a half of somebody explaining to me, I think I'm the best person here to explain it to you. So, spoilers here. If you're trying to watch it, stop and watch it later. Watch this video later. So, now we start. So, because this show is so long, I'm going to say just important bullet points. Okay, so you have have two brothers. You have Sam and you have Dean. And they are looking for the dad, Joe, John, Worcester, Winchester. John is a ghost hunter. Doobie, doobie, doo. Where are you? So stuff like that. Basically, that's how the TV show started. The whole first season, they are killing famous monsters, famous monsters from uh, different mythologies. La Llorona lost her children, or she killed her children, or he start, she eats children. I don't know what she does. They just walk around killing all the Universal Studio monsters, Frankenstein and Dracula and the Mummy. Sam has demon blood. Mm, he's important because of that long hair guy. Another thing that you have to take into account is that God is missing. Nobody knows where is God, nobody knows what is God, nobody knows who is God. What if God was one of us? John, their father, died saving Dean, trading his soul. So he saved Dean, trading his soul, his soul to a demon. Yeah. Then Dean traded his soul to save Sam. This happened quite a lot in the show. After that, Dean is rescued by Castile, a cool angel. Then uh, Lucifer gets unleashed. They find out that they are both vessels for Lucifer and the Archangel Michael. Because, yeah, after that, they meet their new brother Adam. They just met him. Adam and Sam decide to get possessed by Michael and Lucifer. They jump in hell, getting trapped themselves, but also trapping Michael and Lucifer. So they say the thing, but they are both in hell. Sam is arrived without a soul. So basically, he's kind of a douche. Castle becomes all snooty and powerful and declares himself God. Bobby, the spiritual dad of the kids, died. Why? 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 <laughs> Dean and Castile got stuck in the purgatory. Let's just call him Cass. So Dean and Cass got stuck in the purgatory. Then Dean returns again. Yeah, you know. This guy called uh, Mr. Crowley wants to be the king of hell. He tried to close the door to hell, but this person, Megatron, closed the door to heaven. And every angel thinks it was their fault or they are really angry at them. Cass is human now. He doesn't have angel powers. Sam is going to die, but then he gets possessed by the guy who left the door open in the garden of Eden and let the snake come in and he gets saved again. Dean got the mark of Cain. You know, the guy in the Bible, famous guy. Yeah, it's an evil mark, like evil stuff. Dean gets killed and he's turned into a demon. I think probably because of the mark. Now Dean and Mr. Crowley, the king of hell, they are best buddies now. <laughs> Dean gets turned into a human again by drinking blood. That's what all humans do. Duh. Also, he still has the mark and he's really crazy. Crowley's mom appears. She's a witch. Dean asks Death for help, but for that to happen, he has to kill Sam, his brother. At the end, Dean kills Death. Yes. Crowley's mom erases the mark and escapes with the Book of the Damned. Oh, and also, an evil older than God is released. That's the last 10 years of Supernatural. I'm probably missing a lot of stuff. I don't know. It's a lot. I'm doing the best I can here. But I'm probably going to start watching it. Oh, yeah. Lucky's there. Yeah, I hope you like it. You show your support, right? You like it, you share it, you should. Just study 10 years of mythology and demons and angels and names, a lot of names. All the names of the angels are similar because I wanted to show you that. 